Hallelujah, hallelujah, praise Yah, everybody. Praise Yah another time. Amen and amen. This is your sister, Carrie Ann, in Jesus Christ. Okay, brothers and sisters, I think now what I'm about to say um, is something that the Lord has rested on my heart. I did a Facebook post about it. The Lord just said, right. And I began to write on my Facebook about, I think it was yesterday, a couple of days ago. And brothers and sisters, listen to me. <clears throat> listen to me very, very carefully. I know that we talk about the three days of darkness, right? We talk about, we talk a lot on this channel. We talk a lot on this channel about the three days of darkness and it should store up stuff. But... Keep storing up, not only because of the food shortages that is going to happen and the water contamination and all of that, brothers and sisters. But this, what I'm saying is extremely serious because it's high in my spirit. And I know that this is not far off. I don't have a date, okay? But it is not far, uh, far off. It is a high season. And what I saw in my spirit, brothers and sisters, that the wicked, oh, these, these, these Ramesses, these Ramesses too, brothers and sisters, if I could show some of you who believe in the Ramesses is how wicked they are, you would really be so surprised that you're following these people and you believe everything that they say that comes out of their demonic mouth. They're so wicked. But the Ramesses too, the wicked demonic modern day pharaohs of this world, brothers and sisters, they are, they, they, yeah, they will temporarily. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lord, thank you. I'm, oh Lord, I'm seeing this in my spirit. As I'm talking to you and I'm about to say what I'm saying, I saw in the realm of the spirit, um, tanks. Tankers. Ta the vision is true. I have to try to find that vision where I saw soldiers were like backing the turners. You know, they were protecting them to do evil, so to speak. So as I'm talking to you, I'm going to go back to what I'm going to say about the wicked pharaohs. But I just want to release what I just seen in the spirit as I'm talking to you. I just saw tankers and soldiers on the street with the turners like they were directing them what to do where to go and stuff like that so let's just pause that right there for a minute let me go back to what the lord is saying about this wicked ramesses pharaoh so these wicked modern day pharaoh all over the world brothers and sisters they are gonna close the shop and i saw in the spirit for about two three weeks or something like that no shop open you, you you cannot phone online and buy stuff because nobody is going to be allowed to go on the streets. And this is because of the Turner's event that is going to happen. So this is the reason why I'm saying to you that these some of these wicked soldiers and wicked police, they're going to work with the Turner's. And so what I saw, what the Lord showed me, is that the shops will be closed. And I saw in my spirit two weeks, it may be longer. Two or three weeks, I don't know how long it's going to be. But it's going to definitely close. And it's going to go into the two weeks period. So you've got to have food. And I know you're going to say, it's a carrier. When is it? You're going to know. Don't worry about it. You're going to know. All right, you're going to know because you're going to see them. And it's going to be on the news. It's going to be on the news that people are acting strange. That's what they're going to say. And they're going to show you. They're going to video it. They're going to show you and all of that. When you see that begin to happen, as soon as you see that begin to happen, that is your cue. If you don't have food and stuff in the house, get to your nearest supermarket, buy what you can and get home. Buy what you can and get off the streets. All right, you might say, well, what about me family and friend who have taken, do you know what they're going to turn? Well, we're praying that they don't because we're praying that they're covered and need to covering because yeah, is still good because not everybody will turn. Not everybody will turn. I've been saying that from day one. Not 
everyone will turn. And in natural fact, somebody sent me an email today. A beautiful sister in the most. Uh, yeah, <laughs> you sent me an email. It's your sister Carrie, and I know you've done loads of videos. And you say that not everyone's going to turn. But she mentioned something about saline water. What if, do you know what, some of the people got the saline and all of that. It's a possibility. Not ruling anything out, but the, but, but the fact of the matter, what the Lord said to me, not everybody is going to turn. He didn't tell me about Selah and he didn't, he didn't so it, you know, I know when we prophesy, we know in part, we prophesy in part. So it may be, it may be true. Selah and business may be involved in it, along with the real, you know what, thingy bobby, thingy bobby. So, but you know, <clears throat> if it's a case, you're in a house, your loved one begins to act up. I don't think they're going to be, I think because you've got the Holy Spirit inside of you. Because you've got to remember that greater is he that is inside of you than he that is in the world. And, and so therefore, your power will subdue that one, that loved one. Okay? And, um, and so keep them safe. I wouldn't, you know, and, you know it's, it's a difficult one because <clears throat> we don't know how... The strength of these people. But like I said, with the spirit of the Most High, yeah, inside of you, your house has been covered, you, sh you will be okay. You will be okay. Um, but, don't, but, but, but the wicked Ramesses, the wicked Pharaohs, they're going to close all the shops. Brothers and sisters, it's very important that when you see the sign, because they're going to be signed, when you see the sign of the Turner's event, you know what time it is. Don't dilly-dally. You go and get your stuff. ASAP and get off the streets. Get off the streets. All right? The soldiers, because, you know, they're going to deal with these people. They know what to do. Because in the end, what's going to happen, the wicked pharaohs are going to come back and say, oh, what a miracle. We'll, we'll, we'll clean up the turners. We'll, yeah. And they're going to declare the shops to be reopened again. It's all planned. They're so wicked. Say, oh, Satan is just, uh, yeah, terrible, terrible evil. Um, so the soldiers will be working with the Turners. And eventually, yes, people will go back on the streets because the soldiers will take the Turners to an unclosed it's an unclosed or an undisclosed location. And I'm going to do a video about that one. I've got a very powerful video about the undisclosed location of the Turners. I have a very powerful video that I'm going to do concerning that. All in time prophecies, brothers and sisters. But what I'm telling, what I'm saying to you, the Lord showed me in the realm of the spirit that I should warn the people. Warn the people. This is for the good, the bad, and the ugly that has not turned. Warn the people that when they see this event, when the people, when the Turners events start to happen, you will know. It's not like you're going to be blind and you don't know. You will know. Go and stock up as much as you can, at least for two or three weeks worth of stuff you need. And the water as well. Make sure you have bottled water. Don't, I, I want to fool around with the, with the top water to drink it, brothers and sisters. I want to fool around with it to drink it. So make sure you got your, your bottled waters and stuff stored up. So, like I say, at the beginning of this video, I know I talk about the three days of darkness and to store up and, and, and all of that. But this that is coming, when you see it, and you will, when you see it in its um, fruition, and numbers, then you know that, okay, <clears throat> this is serious. All right? This, this is serious. Um, I've talked about the blue and purple light. If I've seen that video, you need to watch it. But the soldiers, the Lord, the vision is true. I need to find that vision where I saw the soldiers working with the Turner. They were on the Turner's side. They literally, like they were supporting the, the, these turned people. <laughs> uh, 
But I'll try to find that video. If I can find a video where, the, where I had that powerful vision where the soldiers were literally, what they were doing, what the soldiers were doing in this video, they were um, holding up people who were rushing to go home. That's it. Thank you, Lord. Wicked soldiers. They were holding up the people, asking them loads of questions. You know when the you know when they're dilly dallying. They do, you know, a night was coming down, and these people had to go home because I was one of them. And by the time the soldiers let us through, the Turners were, yeah, were coming out in the droves, brothers and sisters. Listen, I know a lot of you are watching this, watching this channel, and think, oh, what is she on about? This is end time prophecy. This is what this channel is about. End time prophecy. And if you want to know anything end time, you come on this channel. If you want your family, families and friends to know about the end times, you refer them to this channel. Because this is what it's all about. And I know that some people's heart cannot take it. Because it's like, it's, it's too much. But it's better that you know now and you can prepare than you don't know anything and you're in oh, what's happening i don't know what's happening i'm confused but what i'm telling you is going to be a temporary proper when you talk about lockdown i mean they've been doing lockdown but some shops open at certain time and you can come out at certain time and then they close it no this is going to be a full it's like martial law full-blown moons something you've never seen before shops locked for two weeks never seen that in our entire life the whole place all right yeah hurricane comes we know that two to three four days maybe tops four days maybe and shops are reopened maybe after two days after the hurricane the place is open but with this brothers and sisters we're looking at two weeks spam it could be a little bit more but god is gracious yeah is good but what i get in my spirit is definitely it's, it's going to go into the two weeks realm of locking down the place because of the turners walking up and down and carrying on on the streets but the funny thing about it is that some people are going to take it for a joke let's go hunt you mustn't go on the streets because if the turners don't get you the soldiers will they will shoot at will because all powers are going to give to the soldiers the bible says in saint matthew when jesus christ of nazareth was talking to his disciples because his, his disciples wanted to know about the end times they wanted to know what was going to come before the messiah returns they wanted to know so they asked the question, what shall be these things? What shall be the sign of your coming? And one of the things that Jesus ta taught the, 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 um, the disciples is this. Men hearts. This is Christ speaking. Men hearts will fail them. Not maybe or could, no. This is a hundred percent. Men hearts will fail them for looking. Hallelujah. At the things coming upon the earth, brothers and sisters, take heed to prophecy. These things are coming. Satan is creating his own world and he's going to get it for, well, it's a seven year tribulation. But the three and a half years, he's going to get it. It's going to run into the seven years, don't get me wrong. But he's going to achieve it, brothers and sisters. Men hearts will fail them for looking at the things coming up on the earth. Looking at, looking at these things coming up on the earth. It is coming, brothers and sisters. So I wanted to come. And I did say on my Facebook page, I did say that I'm going to make a video. I said I'm going to make this statement into a video i had to i had to um but it's 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 a it's really about the it's really about the preparation preparing yourself for the for the turners um for the shops closing two weeks at least at least that at least that because the wicked pharaohs are going to drag it out aren't they they're going to drag it out they're going to drag it out. Because you've got to understand that they control them. They know how to control them. 
This is why they're working with, those, with the wicked soldiers. Because they know what to do to control these people. So wicked. So sad. So wicked and so sad, brothers and sisters. You must keep in prayer. Please. This is not... The, no, I'm talking... It is not the mark of the beast. It's not the three sixes. Not yet. It is coming. The three sixes are coming. And when it comes, it will... Some of us are going to the wilderness, isn't it? But when it comes, you'll know. Revelation 13 will fulfill right in your eyes. There, there won't be no ifs, buts, or maybes. But we still can pray for our people that have disobeying. We can pray. Prayer changes things. And I'm in prayer. I am, I am in prayer. I'm literally in prayer, praying and asking the Lord to have mercy. You know, it's not God. Some people will be okay. Hallelujah. I know that some people who have gotten the you know what will be completely fine. Completely fine. Others, yeah, won't be that blessed. Put it that way. Um, so, yeah, be bold, be strong, be courageous, walk with Yah. Just like Enoch, all praises, all beautiful praises to the Most High, Yah, who lives above the heavens, Yah, eternally bless you. I love you all, <clears throat> and I will see you soon, someday in glory. In Jesus Christ, precious holy name, amen and amen. Let us say the benediction together. The benediction is, <clears throat> got my throat, sorry brothers and sisters. The benediction is Jude chapter 1, verses 24 to 25. We agree with the servant of the Most High, Yah. Brother Jude, how he expresses how beautiful the uncreated Yah is. Uh, let us read. If you've got your Bibles, read with me. If you don't know it, just learn. Don't worry yourself. You will get to know it. The Bible reads, Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. To the only wise God, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Amen and amen. Amen. Blessings. Amen.